Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel or if you're new here, welcome for the first time. As you guys can tell by the title of the video, I'm going to be doing a little bit of an Amazon finds for some clothing and then some home decor stuff as well. I recently started to get into the like Amazon finds kind of niche, I guess. Um, I've always shopped on Amazon, like I have Amazon Prime, but I've honestly not known for the longest time like where to find all of the cute stuff on Amazon that everyone else gets like I know that it's out there I just don't know how to find it but one of the bloggers that I recently started to follow like was sharing a bunch of different Amazon finds on her Instagram I'll put her handle on here because her stuff that she finds is so stinking cute and one night I just went down a rabbit hole with one of my friends going through Amazon finds so I ordered some stuff I got it in this week and I'm going to be sharing all of it it's all like very neutral simple affordable stuff you guys can tell by my style is very neutral and minimal um, but yeah all like super cute stuff too good not to share and if you guys are interested in like shopping any of these items um, most of the retailers too like the brands that all of these came from have a lot of cute stuff as well i'll make sure that i link them in the description box down below and with that let's just get into the finds i think i'm gonna start with clothing first and then we'll move into the home decor stuff so the first clothing piece i got was this oversized west coast best coast sweatshirt if you guys didn't know i live in portland the pacific northwest is my home and even though it's kind of cheesy i honestly wanted like a little west coast sweatshirt i just thought it was cute honestly and the color looks like really yellow in the viewfinder it honestly does look more yellow than i thought it was going to be i thought it was going to be more beige but either way it's still cute especially for like summertime oh i ordered this in a medium i'm usually like an extra small small but i wanted to make sure that it was oversized i would definitely size up in this um if you want it to be oversized and cute the inside is like this super soft fleece lining so i know this will be nice for like summer nights but yeah just cute little sweatshirt right there and it was also like super affordable too i think it was maybe like 20 dollars. and the second piece of clothing i got was a cardigan actually don't ask me why i'm buying cardigans in the middle of summer but you know what i wear cardigans year round i'll just throw it over like a bodysuit or tank top like this and a pair of shorts or jeans and be good to go in the summertime so i also like chunky sweaters are my weakness so i saw this chunky sweater it's gonna look way better i think unbuttoned than buttoned because it looks like a very grandma style sweater right now but i saw it on the model and thought it was super cute it has these like really long sleeves that you can cuff and i like that little detail too so i just picked up this oversized neutral sweater it felt like i could totally wear it through the summer as a layering piece and then definitely into fall um and this can just like live in my closet forever and then the next clothing piece i got was much more summer appropriate it's this little knit tank top and this is actually one of the finds that i was recommended by that blogger that i follow on instagram she finds a ton of like cute little neutral minimal pieces like this i believe this tank top is a one size fits all looks like it kind of fits like an extra small to a small but it's also super stretchy so there are tons of like reviews though from people so you can definitely figure out from everyone's reviews and like their measurements and stuff if this one will fit you but yeah i thought that this was just like a really easy little throw on piece it would pair really well with the cardigan i just got and i love the knitted details on it and then last up i got a little bit more of like an accessory actually i saw this hair scarf um on amazon they had like 20 different prints to choose from i've been saving on pinterest like a really minimal handbag and then tying a scarf like this onto it i'll actually get one of my handbags and show you guys what i mean okay so this is a minimal purse that i got um actually as a graduation present and i haven't worn it out yet it's because i haven't really had a reason to like we're in a pandemic right now and i haven't been dressing very nice when i go out anyways but this is i'm just like whipping this on here right now but doing something like this just to dress up a really minimal purse i thought was so cute um i definitely want to get some more like neutral colored ones too but for some reason i saw this and just really liked all of the little colors on it these are definitely like the accent colors that i go for when i'm like decorating inside or like in my stationary planners things like that so yeah cute little hair scarf so many colors to choose from it feels 
it's really good quality. You could totally wear it as like a hair scarf or around your neck. Maybe even do one of those like scarf tops. I've never tried that myself, but definitely like a versatile little piece. So that is everything that I have clothing wise. Moving into the home decor. Home decor was actually the reason that I was looking on Amazon since I'm still trying to find little pieces to decorate my apartment and finish that up. I was looking for home decor. I ended up getting clothes at the same time, but I did find this. I believe it's a chenille. I don't actually know how to say that fabric throw blanket. I was looking for something nice and neutral for my couch to go with my new pillows and all of that. So this one is super fuzzy. I'm really picky about my blankets. It like needs to be something nice and cozy. And I feel like all of the blankets I was seeing at like Target and Ikea, the ones that I like the look of weren't actually cozy. So it would literally just be there for the looks. But I saw this one on Amazon. I believe it was like 20 to $25 pretty good deal for a throw blanket I think. Um, it's lightweight but like in a good way and it has these little tassels on the end. This actually came in a couple different colors. Same print, I just got the most neutral one. But yeah, really happy with this find and it's gonna pair perfectly in my living room. Okay, I'm not really sure how to show this lamp in this video besides just doing this. I actually already showed this lamp in a previous video that I did showing all of like my affordable studio apartment decor because I've had had this lamp for like three months now since I moved into my apartment but since this was an Amazon finds video and I literally love this lamp I just had to throw it in here I got this lamp on Amazon a couple months ago and it just sits on my bedside table what I love about it and I've convinced so many people to buy this is it has two USB chargers on the side so I can just like plug in my phone at night and it sits right there and I don't have to like fumble for the power cord underneath my bed to try and plug in my charger there and the other really cool thing is to turn it on you actually just tap the base of the lamp it's obviously not plugged in right now but it has three different like dimming settings and you just tap it like one two three to change them and tap the fourth time to turn it off so I thought that was like really convenient and cool and then the last piece of home decor I have I'm actually gonna have to do like a cutaway clip it's this coffee table right in the middle of my living room that I just got I have been searching far and wide on the internet to find a coffee table like this since I live in a studio and my living room is basically connected to my kitchen, it's like all one big living space, I wanted to find a coffee table that was like really portable, it didn't feel chunky and like it took up a lot of space. So I really like the idea of getting a nesting table so I can either have like one of the pieces there, I can like move them around a lot. And this was such a good find. It was under $50, the easiest thing to put together. Like all you have to do is screw the legs into the top and you are done. It feels really good quality too. Honestly, my coffee table is like, it needs to be functional and like I can put stuff on it, but it doesn't have to be the most high quality thing I've ever had. So I felt like this was a really good find. It also comes in like a gray top as well, but I went for just the white. I saw a lot of similar styles on other kind of like home furnishing websites that were a lot more expensive, but I just thought the Amazon find one was the way to go. Okay guys, that is everything I have for my super quick Amazon finds video. This was my first one, but I was honestly so impressed by everything I got. I might just become one of those Amazon find people. You never know. It depends on how much more good stuff I can find on Amazon. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any favorite like Amazon find bloggers or storefronts feel free and leave them in the comments below like i can scroll on amazon for literally hours on end <laughs> so thank you so much for watching and i hope to see you guys in my next video bye